Welcome to this episode of Video Drone by DIY3dtech.com. We're out here in the wilderness and we're going to do a, a flight over this ravine and river down here. This is the the Black River. So we got the Spark all set up. So I've checked. I've got approval to fly here. So I'm going to take it up. I'm going to take it out over there, get some video, and let's see how all this works. So I'm going to be uh, using the iPhone 5S today because uh, i got a, a little bit of glare. And so we're going to take it up, and we're just going to kind of let it set in there. And I want to start the video, and I believe I have the video started. Now the interesting part, I want to back it up. So let's back it up. I'm going to gimbal it down, and then just take it out over the way here. And I have to take it up higher. And we're taking it out over out over the river and we're just kind of looking down. And there we are. We're up over the river. And I want to keep gaining some altitude here. Is there some trees? And I want to yacht back around. And then I want to gimbal up because I want to see a little bit what's ahead of me. I can still I can still hear it. And I want to take it up a little bit more. I'm at about 30 meters. And I want to yaw it around. And I want to bring it back up the river. Just kind of moseying it back. Just kind of taking it up the river. I want to make sure I don't run into because as I move this way, it's it's kind of uh, I don't want to run it. I don't want it to run uphill. And let's bring it back around again. And I want to gimbal. So there's the horizon. Let's give Norbert a quick little yaw party as we uh, kind of look around the horizon. Let's get some horizon shots. And we're just looping it around a little bit. A little bit of weather might be getting ready to blow in. And I want to gimbal it down. So there's the river again. So I'm going to take it back down. Battery's still looking pretty good. It's kind of yawn the stick back around. I'm kind of watching. This is a little bit of a new area, so uh, the height changes rather quick. Looks like some damned area. It's 
some lumber or something. Trees kind of blown over. We're going back out the rapids. You can call them the rapids out down that way. Out flying back away. Okay. I'm getting a ways out there, so I am going to work on turning around and actually bringing it back a little bit. So let's turn it back around towards the home point. And we're turning it back towards the home point. I want to turn it up so I'm looking at the horizon a little bit. And then I want to start bringing it back towards me because now I'm pointing towards the home point. I want to make sure I'm not going to run into any trees or anything. It is counting down. So I'm now, that's the important thing. When it starts counting down, that's a good thing. So I'm at, uh, I'm out there 130 meters roughly. I'm up about 33 meters from my height, so about 150 feet up. So I'm just kind of bringing it back in. I want to make sure I'm not uh, going to run into anything. Because again, I'm sitting over here, you guys can see the ravine. And so I took off from the ravine and I, I need to come land back in the same area over here. So, uh, okay, there we are. So good, good, good. We're in a good position. So we need to bring her back around this way. And... And let's bring her back down a little bit in altitude. You can see it up there. And we're bringing her back down. Just bring her down in altitude a little bit because I want to turn her towards me. And bring it back. And kind of steering off into the sun. So I want to be careful. I want to hit this before I get to return to home. So I want to bring this over this way. want to bring it down and just real quick before I set it down I want to save the video and then I want to bring it down and we got it set down so just before low battery so that was a pretty good flight actually so we took it up and out over this way, out over the uh, Black River. You can see, maybe see the Black River down there. So uh, we took it out over there. And we took it actually quite a ways that way. So as the river comes down and bends down there. So anyways, I think a uh, pretty good flight of the Spark. I tell you what, I just love this because, you know, I was just driving by here, seeing a great area. I checked hover and, um, you know, came out flew this and th this would be very difficult with the Phantom 3 um, to be honest with you so uh, you know again just how easy it is set up throughout their go it's inconspicuous so definitely a big thumbs up for the Spark I love the Spark and so tell you what subscribe button is going to be coming up over there let me know in the comments below what you're thinking and today was just a bologna sandwich for lunch it was not an exciting day at all folks so cheers see you in the next video